Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm doing your monthly reading for the month of September 2018. This is going to start from the 1st of September till the 15th of September 2018. And this reading is going to be for the sign of Virgo. So let's see what's coming up for Virgos uh, for the first 15 days of September 2018. I will pull just uh, two cards for your general energies, two cards for your love life, two cards for your career. Um, so let's see what's coming up for uh, you for um, for the first 15 days of September. Um, I will pull one uh, card from the Romance and Jericho cards too for your romance guidance. So let's start the reading. For your general energies, you do have the Magician, the Ten of Cups, wow, good. For your work and career, you do have the Justice and the Nine of Cups, awesome. <laughs> After quite some time now, it's like, you know, these are the good cards coming up for you and good energies, I would say. For your love life, you do have Eight of Cups and then comes the Fool, wow, awesome. You do have the Page of Swords underneath, so... Let's see what's coming up for you. Um, looks amazing. And you do have the Magician and Ten of Cups for your general energies. So I do believe that um, for um, you are going to start the month um, on a very, very, very positive note. And you will be feeling... Um, joyful you will be feeling on top of the world you will be feeling um like you have everything that you desired of and um when it comes to your general energies and if i apply that on your love life i do feel like you um you choose to move um you choose to walk away from something and that's something um it's it's more like uh, if i if i you know look uh, back at the readings that i did for you earlier uh during the last month and the month before that uh there has been some negativity around you but now i believe that you are uh, walking away from that negative aspects of you and your nature and the relationships that you were in or um, if if things didn't work out for you in your past relationships now you are letting go of that and you are walking into uh, into something new whether uh, that your general energies whether that your work life whether that your love life uh, you choose to walk away from something being hurt, but that hurt eventually will end up being something good for you because it was meant to happen. This hurt, this pain that you went through was meant to happen. And that has made you a better person, I believe. And now you can... Um, it's more like you have learned the lesson and now you are walking into something new with positivity and um, with no strings attached from the past, I believe. It's like you are ready to start off something new, something magical, something beautiful, something fulfilling, something uh, which has no negativity connected to it. And I do believe that that you are with the page of swords here and underneath that you do have the um page of wands and underneath that you do have the eight of swords energy so i believe that you let go of that self-sabotaging energy self um destroying energies that you were having earlier and now you are like you know um now you're ready to go for your life with you know full of passion and clarity of mind with the page of swords i do believe you are ready to cut off the things that you were uh, that were no longer you know that you believe is no longer serving your purpose so you d you decide to walk into uh it's it's like you know you 
you um you have to you know go through this pain you had to go through this pain so you could grow as a person and that is exactly what i can see in all the cards coming up for you or all the energies that are you know that you're gonna be facing in the month of september at least for the first 15 days of september and i do believe seeing the this row of cards it's like you know it's gonna um it's gonna go in the positive flow because this is what has uh, has set up the tone for the start of the month and it will eventually come and become more positive and more good and in your and plus in your favor too and in the favor of your dreams and wishes too um with the magician card and the ten of cups it seems like um something might have happened in your life uh, be that, you know, it could be that, you know, it could be something related to your love life that, you know, has made you a better person now or something that has happened um, in your surroundings that has made, that has completely changed you and changed your pers uh, perspective or, uh, about everything in your life or in fact about yourself most importantly. And now you you are uh, you feel powerful. You feel uh, connected to the source because it's it's more like you know when you are connected to the source when you are um, when you are uh, it's it's more like when you are vibrating at the frequency of love and abundance. It's like that kind of energy that I'm picking up with the magician card here because it's it's like you know everything that you would desire will flow into your life effortlessly and that's exactly what her, what the energies I'm picking up with the first two cards here uh the ten of cups it it's like you are going to be in the abundant flow of life and you could feel it from every bit of yourself and it's 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 going to be uh, when it comes to your work life, I do believe you do have the justice and the nine of cups. So maybe, um, it it could go it could go hand in hand. Maybe that has brought the change in you, or maybe this uh justice card in your work life might be the key to change you and your perspective about different things in your life. Maybe that has made you a better person now since you have started something new, or now since you know, um what what i can remember from your past readings that i did um you have had this very much uh, influenced life that that i believe you were influenced by the people who are at a higher post from you or people who are you know in, influential when it comes to your home life be that your father be that you're some somebody you know uh, dominant in your life and i believe with the justice card here i do feel like um and the magician too it's and you walking away from something when it comes to your love life it's like you know um it's going to bring about a new change um in your life where you where where you will be rewarded for uh everything that has been um making you feel stuck because of that particular thing in your in your life like Things gonna start flowing. Things gonna start improving in your life, and it. I, I I strongly pick up the energies of your work and your love life connected, when it comes to this um, you know, influential person that was in your life, and I do believe with the justice here. Um, if you were working for somebody, and if you were not uh independent, um, or if you were uh you know if you had, um you have had you know this time when you could not take decisions of your life now since the justice card is here you are going to get what you want and you will be able to take can you see this sword and this uh justice in the hand of this man sitting over there it's like you know you are cutting off everything it's like you know ace of swords energy that i'm picking up with that and it's like you are just cutting away people who who were you know keeping you abound um in whatever area of your life and it's like now you are ready to free yourself and even if you are not ready it's like you know things have been pushed um for you 
to you know give you a free way or so you could achieve or you could go for your dreams and wishes and that's exactly what's coming when it comes to your work life you are going to have um what you wished for you are going to start something new where you would no long uh, where you would be no longer in the you know um in this um um in this you know particular um influence of this person that you were dealing with in your previous job and if if it's you starting a new business you will have it in um exact the way you wish to have it for like you know it's it's more like you will be getting your wish granted with this particular um justice that you are going to get in your life and um, for those of you who who have been stuck in a court case uh the the result or the you know the um uh, uh the uh, outcome of that particular case would be in your favor and you will be uh um you will be getting um in fact like it will go in your favor plus you will be having um maybe for some of you you might be getting lots of money out of that particular court case or for some of you you would be getting um something that was uh that was kind of you know um um it's it's going to be something big something big that that could make you have your wishes fulfilled it's it's going to be if it's something regarding money then you might be getting a handsome amount of money uh back because of this court case that you just will win or would have you know you might have already won the case um or uh, if you are still in the process of getting through this case then you are going to get uh this case in your favor and um that will make you um have a very strong position and it's going to you know just free you from all the um uh it's it, it's going to free you from everything that that was you know uh keeping you uh, keeping you tied up in a situation and it's like you are going to free yourself and that freedom will um lead you to something beautiful and something successful when it comes to your a career as well when it comes to your love life and it's like you are walking away from something and you are um for those of you who want to be in a relationship with somebody they uh you have had in the past um i do pick up the energies of you kind of letting go of your past i don't think you would be considering uh to be with that person anymore it's like you will choose to walk away from it you will choose to uh cut off everything that was in your past and now you are kind of ready to uh just have a leap of faith and jump into something um something new something beautiful something exciting and you are ready to explore different new things in your life you don't want to get um i do pick up the energies of you don't want to get tied up in any situation as of now because it it this freedom that you just gained um means a lot to you and you don't want to get tied to anybody you don't want to get tied to any um um get tied into any relationship you want to be as free as the fool here it's like he or she doesn't have to uh be he or she is not answerable to anyone that's exactly what i see uh for you that you want to be as free as you as anybody in the world could be where you don't have any restrictions where you don't have any um uh, uh, liabilities where, where you don't have any responsibility it's only you and you and your happiness and your wishes that you want to focus on with the magician card here even if you want to go for any relationship i believe that you do have since can you see this um cup over there and then this pentacle there um there uh it's it's more like you know you you are the magician right now if you want to go for it you can have whatever you want after you get done with this court case or after you have the justice that you have been waiting on for and after you just you know walk away from this past situation um i do believe you can have whatever you desire but i do feel and i do pick up the energies of you not going for any relationship as of now you don't want to do that you want to um 
explore the life being alone. You don't want to get tied into any situation because you have been hurt in the past for whatever uh, reason. It didn't work out for you the way you wanted it to and you are not ready to go for it. Um, I don't know why I'm picking up the energies of you after having this alone time. You might be going back to this old person. I don't know why I'm picking up that energy. But that is something I'm picking up very strongly here. You want to enjoy some alone time so you could... Um, um, it's, it's more like, you know, you are going to have some alone time and then you are going to uh, miss that person that you that you uh, had in the past. And I believe you will be going back to that person. And this time around, I do feel like you will end up being with that person in a very positive way and where you will not be or you will not have to walk away from that person. It's, it's going to be a very fulfilling relationship with that person. Um, so that's exactly what I'm picking up for uh, you for this, um, for these 15 days of, uh, September 2018. So let me take a, uh, let me take a card from the Romance and Jericho cards, uh, for your love guidance. So let's see what's coming up for you for, um, for the first 15 days of September. <clears throat> so let's see. Flood. There you go. I told you you're not ready for any relationship. Um, extend your light-hearted energy to others. But it, like I said, like even though you're gonna flirt around, even though you're gonna, if if you choose to flirt around, you can. But I don't, I don't feel like you're gonna go for that because it's it's more like you want to have fun. Maybe if you're a girl, uh, you might be hanging out with your uh girls' gangs, and if you're a male, you would be hanging out with your male friends. I don't pick, I don't feel like you know this is what you're gonna go for um but having said that um I do feel like whenever you would be ready in the future um you will be going back to your uh so going back to somebody from your past I'm picking up that energy very strongly so let's see what comes up for you after the 15th of uh, September I will be doing the remaining month reading uh so we will see what comes up for you for uh for the later part of the month um but for now that's pretty much it coming up for you for the first 15 days of uh, September 2018 um, if the reading resonated with you, do like, subscribe and share. And if you are willing to get a personal reading, you can reach out to me on my uh, email ID given in the description box. So um, I will see you in the next reading. Till then, take care and bye bye.